How do you add the famous Ken Burns effect in Camtasia? It's basically a pan and zoom effect and it's named after a famous director called Ken Burns who made it popular. To do that in Camtasia, go here under animations and if you scroll down, there's going to be two animations called scale up and scale down, depending on which way you want to go. Do you want to zoom in and pan or do you want to zoom out and pan? In our case, let's go with scale up drag and drop this here on our clip and it will basically start from this point right here uh, this dot the full frame and it's going to zoom in and pan to this other dot right here so let's adjust that first by changing the scale i want to zoom in quite a lot like this and then i'm going to grab this x right here to adjust the positioning let's say i want to focus on a specific area here with some information so right now this entire effect happens here on this arrow, but the whole point of the Ken Burns effect is that it happens throughout the entire clip. So then you just drag the, uh, oops, you just drag the dots, the first one all the way to the beginning to start there. And you want to drag the ending all the way to here. So it finishes zooming in and panning all the way to here. So let's play back and see what we have. As you can see, it just pans and zooms really smoothly in the corner throughout the entirety of the video. So this is how you add a Ken Burns effect in Camtasia. For high quality stock animation assets that you can use in Camtasia with drag and drop simplicity so that you can have professional animations at your fingertips within minutes, make sure to visit videoplasty.com.